Magdalena Carmen Redacalo y Calderón was born in July 1907 in Coyoacán, near Mexico City. However, she used to say that she had been born with the beginning of the Mexican Revolution in 1810. At seven years old, she contracted polymalitis, which caused her a deformation in her right foot. Seven years later, she was in an accident and the bus that drove her home from the National Preparatory School where she studied medicine. An accident that would forever change her life. Because of this, Frida was in bed for almost two years. Her mom ordered her a special easel so that she could paint. In 1929, Frida married Diego Rivera. Frida Kahlo re reflected her physical pain from her column her emotional pain caused by Diego Rivera in her abortions, cultural aspects, and her political inclinations in her art. In this painting, Frida shows her physical pain that she felt the, major the majority of her life. Since she spent the majority of her life in hospitals because of her broken column from the accident and also for her right foot. Orla Campos, a friend from Fr of Frida, says that since her childhood until the year 1951, Frida received 32 surgical operations on her spine and on her right foot. In accordance with the writer Pili Egea, this painting of Frida shows the two Fridas, the married and the single. The married one wears a Tawano dress of bright colors of her Mexican nationality and the love of her husband Diego Rivera. On the other hand, the single one wears a white European dress. In addition, the married Frida holds a little Diego in her hand. In change, the single Frida holds scissors that cut an artery, representing the failure of her marriage with Diego and her abortions. In my birth, from 1932, Frida said that this is a painting that shows how she had been born, but at the same time, this work shows Diego Rivera's son that she lost in a, a spontaneous abortion. This type of art was unique around those years, since there, there had never been images painted of women giving birth before. In the love embrace of the universe, Frida is being called by Sihuacuatl, known as the goddess of fertility and of the birth of the Mexican world. Frida shows her frustration for her fer infertility since because of the accident, she was not going to be able to have children anymore. Perhaps this shows her connection with the Sihuacuatl goddess. In addition, here, Frida is holding in her arms a baby with an adult's body. This baby appears to be Diego Rivera. The Mexicanity was an ideology that moved Frida. However, socialism made her join the Mexican Communist Party along with her husband, Diego and their friends. Furthermore, in this drawing from the diary of Frida Kahlo, you can see her support for communism, since she writes in it the name of the name of her political heroes, such as Angels, Marx, Lenin, and Mao. Also, Frida draws the traditional symbols of communism, the hammer and the sickle. Next, we will listen to an audio of Frida Kahlo's voice. Sobre la que nace un pelo oscuro, tan delgado y fino que parece flotar en el aire, es un niño grandote, inmenso, de cara amable y mirada triste. Sus ojos altones, oscuros, inteligentísimos y grandes, están difícilmente detenidos, casi fuera de las órbitas por párpados hinchados y protuberantes como de batracio. Sirven para que su mirada abarque un campo visual mucho más amplio, como si estuvieran construidos especialmente para un pintor de espacios y multitudes, y muy pocas veces desaparece de su boca búdica, de labios carnosos, una sonrisa irónica y tierna. Frida Kahlo dies in July 14, 1954. The cause of her death was an embolism of her lungs. However, there are suspicions that she committed suicide. 